Here's some uh, um, demonstrations you can do with elastic and inelastic collisions. In this box, there's a bouncy ball and a not bouncy ball, right? The one that looks kind of weirdly shiny doesn't bounce. But the other one's just rubber, right? So you can, you can do a magic trick, right? It's like... Right? And then you hit it twice and it's like... Anyway, so, so this one is just a different polymer that doesn't spring back. This one springs back immediately, right? So the question is, for the kids, they've already solved this, right? But we've got a ring stand here. If I put a block of wood, the question is, which one is better at knocking over the block? Okay. I'll put it like right here. So to do it, we just take the, the two. And I had, a, I had a TA, they didn't quite have the same mass, so I had a TA make these the same mass. The, the guy with the big screw thing on it, that's the bouncy guy. Here's this guy, right? And the question is, how high do I have to lift this so that it knocks the block over? And it's something like right there. Boom, right? So just, yeah, you have them memorize that, like, well, how high is it? It's like right there. <laughs> yeah. And you always want to get it, you know, the same spot. On there. And, but, oh, before you do that, have them vote. Because the kids think that this guy that hits it and stops, they think that one definitely is going to knock it over better, right? Which is, of course, not true. And then you take this guy and you put it at the same height. <laughs> it barely tickles it, right? This is definitely higher, right? This is like straight on, there you go, straight out, right? Has to be straight out, even just below the light, slightly like that doesn't do it. Usually I just like, you know, okay. Um, but, but that's cool, right? So, but, but make sure you have a vote on what, which one is gonna knock it over better first, uh, because they need to examine their thoughts, you know? They don't, if they don't make a prediction, uh, they don't learn from the demonstration.